Hey everyone, Edward here at Windows Report and in this video I will show you what to do if you can't download games from Xbox Game Pass on Windows 11. So the first solution that you should always take in consideration is to change your region. To do this press the Windows button then select the settings icon and then on the left pane make sure to click on time and language and then on the right side click on language and region. In here, just scroll down until you find the region section, then click on the drop-down menu next to country or region and make sure to select United States. You'll see that by using this simple approach, you might be able to work around the error and gain access to the desired games. Another great solution is to reset the Windows Store cache. To do this, just press the Windows plus R key to open a run window and then type the following command. Now wait for the command to execute in order to reset the Windows Store cache, then restart the Xbox app. Now you can check if the problem still persists. You can also run the Windows Troubleshooter. To do this, press the Windows button, then select the settings icon, and then on the left pane make sure to click on System, and afterwards on the right side scroll down until you find and select the Troubleshoot section. Now click on Other Troubleshooters, and then again scroll way down until you find the Windows Store Apps Troubleshooter and click on the Run button next to it. Now Windows will try to find any issues and fix them as soon as possible. And lastly, another great solution is to repair or reset the application. To do this, press the Windows button, then select the settings icon, and then on the left pane make sure to click on apps, and then on the right side click on apps and features. In here, under the app list, just click on the search apps box and type in Xbox. Now scroll down until you find the Xbox software and click on the three dots next to it and select advanced options. In here, just scroll down until you find the reset section and start by pressing on the repair button. In this case, the app's data won't be affected at all. But if this step doesn't work, you can also proceed with the reset function. So click on the reset button, but in this case, the app's data will be deleted. So it will be restored to the default settings. And that's it. Plenty of solutions to consider. As usual, for more information and details, you can check the article in the description below. And if you enjoyed this video, just make sure to like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.